Oh, I love this fruit. Oh, Jimmy, this is not a fruit. Then what it is? You know, this is a root of the plant. But nobody eat roots. Yes, you're right. But there are few roots which we eat, like carrot and radish. I want to know more about plants. <coughs> we eat roots of carrot, radish. Let's learn more about roots. See, this is a carrot plant. Can you see carrots on the ground? Yes, this is carrot. Jimmy, see this root is a long single root. These type of roots are called tap roots. Let me show you more tap roots. These are tap roots. These are long and there are side roots also. Oh, does all plants have tap roots? Mostly big plants have tap roots as these have to go very deep. See, the small plants have these fiber type roots. These are called fibrous roots. Oh yes, as the plants are not large in size. Yeah, the small plants have these fiber type roots. Two type of roots, tap roots and fibrous roots. I have one question. What do roots do? Oh, roots bring water and nutrients from ground. Can you see this big thing? Yes, it is stem. All the branches, fruits, leaves are attached to it. Yes, you're right. It provides support to the plant. Look, here's a cut tree. Oh, there are rings in the stem. Can you count these rings? Oh, there are so many. I can't count them. You know, if you can count these rings, you can know the age of the tree. Eh, eh, stem provides support to tree. The number of rings in stem tell the age of the tree. Eh, eh. Oh, these are leaves. These are kitchen of plants. You are right. Who told you? My teacher told me. Yes, it is called the food factory of the plant because Tree prepares fruit here by taking sunlight and carbon dioxide from the air and water through the roots. So roots also help in making food. Leaves, food factory of plants. I would tell you more about leaves. Let me show you leaves by a magnifying glass. Oh, plants have veins like us. Yes, see? There are many veins in a leaf. Hmm. Oh, this is a very big vein. Oh, this is called the midrib. But it is not a vein. Mm. What? What is this? Skin of the leaf? Oh, this is called the blade of the leaf. What is this? See, plant take in dirty air, which we breathe out and give us fresh air. Yes, I know. This dirty air is called carbon dioxide. You are intelligent, Jimmy. Can you tell me the name of the fresh air which plants gives us? Mm, I forgot. It is called oxygen. Eh, eh, plants give us oxygen. Don't plug these flowers. If we keep plucking flowers, there won't be any more flowering plants. Why so? Because in flowers, new seeds are made, from which new plants are born. Eh, eh, flowers, seed store of plants. See these fruits? Flowers turn into fruit. And we eat these fruits. Yes, these fruits are eaten, but they also have seeds. A seed is grown into a new plant. Fruits! Eh, eh, protect seeds! Wow! Now a tree would come out. Yes, after a few days. Seed by magic. Wow! Eh, eh, seed! From where plants live? 
Oh, I can see. This is like a cycle. Here's a test for you. Oh, there are so many things to eat. Yes. Do you know we eat different parts of plant? Yes. This is fruit. This is root. What is this? Oh, this is the stem of the plant. What is this? Oh, these are leaves. And here are seeds. See, we eat different parts of plants. Now, I will show you how plants are useful to us. This is cotton. Yes, clothes are made out of it. Oh, flowers also give us clothes. Here is one more way how plants help us. Oh, they are burning stems. Yes, in villages and jungles, People burn wood to get heat and to cook food. Trees are also home for the birds. Yeah, birds make their nest here and this becomes their home. Oh, plants are so useful. I love them. Yeah, all parts are very useful. We should grow more and more plants. Trees also give us shadow. Yeah, in old times, when people used to feel the heat during the day, they would sit under a tree for the shade.